right now on News Channel 8 at 6. Free to let everybody know one final last time, there is nothing I could do to stop this. His friend stole his SUV, then drove the wrong way on I-275, killing four USF students. Tonight, he talks about that tragedy. Plus, what's being done to keep this from happening at the State Fair again? Tonight, a look at the new security rules. Good evening, I'm Gail Searins. And I'm Keith Kate. Thank you for joining us tonight. It is the question that we've been asking all week. Why did Danny Moritz drive the wrong way on the interstate early Sunday morning? You've probably seen the cell phone video by now. The horrific crash that morning killed Morris, along with four fraternity brothers. Today, for the first time, we heard from one of the last people to see Morris alive. News Channel 8's Chip Wasowski is joining us now from our Tampa newsroom with more on that. And Chip, what did we actually learn today about what led up to this crash that we didn't already know? Right. Well, Keith, I was able to ask Scott Enfinger some questions today. He's the owner of that SUV, and he was Morris's roommate and friend. He was with him in the hours before that crash. Enfinger says Morris had been drinking before the crash, but didn't seem to have too much. He says they were just hanging out, and he can't understand how he ended up going the wrong way on Interstate 275. This is likely the last.